age. Have you ever felt weird while traveling in an elevator? Why do you feel so light sometimes and heavy sometimes when you travel in a lift from ground floor to fourth floor or fourth floor to ground floor? Well, science has answered to your question and let's check it out. Why does it happen? So let's suppose we have a weighing machine with us and we travel in a lift with it. So when the lift goes down with an acceleration A, what happens when we try to measure our weight during the lift going down? So actually, we are exerting a force or weight in the downward direction. Like this. Which is equals to the product of mass of this body into the acceleration due to gravity. At the same time, we also know that by the third law of Newton, if a weight or a force acts in, in some direction, so there is a force that counteracts it, means it acts in the opposite direction and it is equal in magnitude and in this case, we see that force as the normal reaction, which in turn gives us the weight on the weighing machine. So, by the second law of Newton, if we try to find out the net force acting on this body, that can be written as F net is equal to the mass of this body into the acceleration experienced by it, that is small a, that is small a as the lift is going downwards. So if we uh, further calculate or solve the F net for this system or this body, so we can write in a way the F net can be written as W minus N is equals to M A. So if we calculate N from here, it comes out to be M G minus M A. So in a way, when we are traveling in the downward direction in an elevator, we feel some lightness in our body. So let's see what happens when the lift goes up. As the lift goes up, the same case happens. We exert a force or a weight in the downward direction and also the normal reaction in the opposite direction, which is numerically in magnitude equal to the weight of this body. So if the system is, is going in upward direction and it is experiencing some acceleration in the upward direction, so the net force is acting in upward direction. So the net force in a way can be written as N minus W and from the second law of Newton we know that the net force is equal to M into A that is the mass into the acceleration experienced by this body and N minus Mg. So here you can see N can be written as Mg plus MA. That is, whenever we travel upwards or, or in, in from ground floor to any fourth floor or third floor, we feel a sort of heaviness in our body. So let us see what happens when the rope gets break or when the rope of the lift gets loosened. In that case, the lift travels with the acceleration which is equal to the acceleration due to gravity. Applying the same case as we did in the first one that the, that the normal reaction or the weight of the body is simply equals to mg minus ma and in this case the acceleration now is being converted into the acceleration due to gravity and we feel a sense of weightlessness or we feel weightless when the rope gets break. So this was all to discuss in this video. Let us meet in the next video.